All right, guys, welcome back to week 14 of our Lions CFM. We have probably our most important game of the season right here. We are taking on the 9-3 Green Bay Packers. And not only is this a big game because we want to win the NFC North, obviously, but we have bigger aspirations than that. We want the one seed, the first round by the home field advantage. And as it currently stands, we have a one game advantage over everybody else in the nfc there's so many good players right behind us though you know fancy wesley who we lost to last year in the nfc championship pavin still up here david t who we obviously play this week and we play again i believe in only two weeks so yeah no no three weeks we take on the rams then we take on fancy then we take on the Packers and David T once again. So we have four playoff contenders in a row right here. It's going to be an incredibly difficult stretch of games, but I'm ready for the challenge. I wouldn't want it any other way. So with that being said, let's go ahead, deal with some things, jump into the game, and let's move on to 11-2. All right, so we only have one upgrade this week, but it's a big one. JC Horn is going up to an 85 overall, which means he gets his second ability slot. You know, nothing too crazy that, that unlocks there. We do get pick artists, so if the ball is actually thrown towards him, um, you know, hopefully he catches it. There's probably a better chance that he does. There's some other decent abilities back here, like bench press or deep route KO, but I just don't run man coverage. I like to blitz. I like to play zone, so those aren't going to help me. All right, so Packers roster here, Aaron Rodgers with the age reduction is a 99 overall. Incredibly well balanced. Probably one of the best quarterbacks in the entire game. Aaron Jones, a good hybrid back here as well. You know, can hurt you in the run game, can catch the football, run some routes as well. The one-year vet now, Christian Watson, six foot four, 94 speed, looks absolutely filthy. Zay Flowers with X Factor abilities and the 97 speed at wide receiver here. Low overall, but Rico Gafford is going to be a nightmare to deal with. I mean, this team is insane. He's got 94 speed, 96 speed, Stokes and Alexander with abilities. He's got Keyshawn and Nixon and X Factor low overall, but 93 speed. Darnell Savage. He's got Chris Westry here, one of the best users in the entire game. So well rounded, and he had a plus one speed boost up to 95. Adrian Amos here, and then Natrell Jamerson. So Packers, incredibly good. David T, a very solid player as well. We're both fighting for that one seed. This is a massive, massive game. The pressure is on. I can't get complacent here at the end of season two. Let's lock in. Let's get this dub. Let's take down David T. All right, so obviously I normally run this 2-4-5 odd defense, but I know David T doesn't like playing this 2-3-6 will where we run this looping blitz from one of the linebackers. So that's what I'm going to stick with here early on. If he proves he can beat it, we'll go back to the odd, but I, I like my chances here. Oh, I mean, I saw it from the saw it from the jump. Gafford, though, 97 speed. It's hard to get back there in time. George Kittle, I mean, he's pretty quick, man. Oh, I would have loved a block there from Jameson Williams. We might have been off to the races, but I won't complain about a 46-yard dot on the very first play of the game. Oh, Kenny Clark comes out of nowhere. Swift, come on, baby. Nice moves, kid. Nice moves. I really thought about trying Kittle right there, but I'm not going to take, you know, a big risk here early on in the game. We'll throw a guaranteed dot up to the 10. And David likes to cover two blitz a lot right here. So we'll see if that holds true. Yep, here it comes. Mm, big hit from Amos. You can see his user going right back to it. He knows I want to go to that. I don't think he knows how to stop it, really. Um, but uh, if he uses it, that's one way to do it, I suppose. That's pretty brutal, man. I mean, that's probably going to cause us to not get seven here. I rolled out of the tackle box. We had a guy in the flat. I feel like we've gotten screwed quite a few times from uh, from intentional grounding calls, man. It seems to be a theme. I don't get very lucky with those, I'm going to be honest. No reason not to go for this now. It's a nice dot. I'm going to no huddle. Yeah, he's going to set his zone drops, which is smart. Oh, 
Oh, George Kittle gets his hands on it, but he gets a stop on the very first drive. It's tough. Someone screamed. I had to throw it. Kittle did get his hands on it. He's just got to catch that football right there. It's a tough catch, but I should have. My user's frozen. Oh, we got to make that tackle, man. Come on. I mean, dude. Like... I know fumbles aren't super common in this game, but that's that's Rico Gafford, who's like three feet tall, bro. And he just spun I mean, it's tough. Too much time, man. It's good defense. <sighs> wow, he just... Is just chucking seams. That's really not that open, man. I can't lie. There we go. Aiden, come on, man. Hold him to three right here, fellas. Hold him to three. Oh, he might have been throwing me one. Oh, let me get the click on right there. I don't know if he was throwing the ball away or if he was testing that cross or he might have been throwing it away. But that's an awesome job holding him to three right there. Gotta just drive down and get points here. We do get ball, so I could potentially milk out the rest of this quarter. But, I don't know, man. Problem is he has three inside stuff, so. Didn't really seem to matter right there. Probably gonna take this one down, I, I won't lie. Go Jameis, off the legs, baby. So off the legs. Come on, kid. Swift. Ooh, it takes a big hit right there, baby. All right, so you get to the two-minute warning. I think we're doing a pretty good job right here. We're not really have, having to try too hard to milk this. Uh, I think it's the right play. George, fight, baby. Fight, George. Oh, I'm lagging. Oh, what the heck? Thankfully, we didn't take a hit stick right there. I might have fumbled. Beautiful pass, man. Come on, George. I'm going to take this down to probably about 16 and call a timeout, I think. Fell out for the stretch right here, but should be easy. DeAndre Swift just taking as much time off the clock here as possible. Kicker extra point. Down three again. We do get ball to half. Ooh. All these kicks are iced, huh? <laughs> there, hey, listen, there was eight mile an hour wind to the side, all right? You can't blame me too much. It actually does hurt. I can't lie. It actually does hurt. <sighs> that was close. I thought about going for the pick, but he has no timeout, so we're just going to go ahead, wrap up, make the tackle. Definitely uh, had a bit of a brain fart right there. Down four. Wish we were down three. <laughs> But you know what? We'll take it. We have a chance to take the lead here out of half, so. I definitely think he's blitzing here. And he does. Woo! Gabe Davis put him on a highlight real kick. Come on, man. Let's go. You know, he likes to blitz. Here it comes. Man, oh, not for two, not for two, not for two, not for two. Winston, 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 Winston. Kittle! Let's go. Good tackle, kid. Kittle was flying right there. This guy just chucks the seam routes, man. He loves that. Holy smokes. I'm literally just stuck with what I got here, fellas. Oh, hell no. What are you throwing, buddy? Oh, maybe a little bit too much. I was trying to, like, regain mo my momentum and run in a straight line. Patrick Peterson making a big-time play for us on the corner route. Yes, sir. Oh, yeah. Part of, like, the Red Sea, Jameson Williams. Man, he got caught up to pretty quickly, though, by Savage, who's considerably slower. 
George, man, come on, kid, the 21-yard dot. Big time completion to George Kittle. We're taking the two-possession lead. I don't think it's, it should be ice. We have the momentum now, but I do got to watch out for the wind. All right, let me lock in real quick. Let me lock in real quick. All right, 19 to 10. We got to just make this do work. You know, he's he's shown a propensity, SAT word of the day, you know, to, to throw the ball deep, hit us over top. So we got to take that away, and uh, we should be all right, man. Uh, damn it, bro. Oh, that's just not a good read, man. Take this for two. Take this for two. Take this for two. JC Horn. The pick artist just acquired. Not that it makes a huge difference right there. We had a great user. We're actually going to take this all the way back, which is big. You know, if he got that two-point conversion, we drove down the field, got seven. It's still a one-possession game. Now, obviously, even if we get three, being up eight is very, very nice. But I want more than that. I want seven. We want to take some clock with us as well. But I'm not too focused on that. I just want to score. Not like this, man. Not like this. I was literally in the process of throwing the ball away. Oh, just so irritating. Go down, go down, please go down, please go down, Patrick Peterson. Oh my god, Patrick Peterson is having a monster game for us. I don't know what this dude is looking at. Why did he throw that? What? Nice dot, George Kittle, man. Come on. I don't care. I don't care if that's Eric Stokes. It's J-Mo Williams, baby. Up top, dropping the bucket, Jamison Winston. James, <laughs> James Winston. I'm still getting the names mixed up. All right. We take the 12-point lead. Ah, uh, he's manned up, but Bobby Price, not, uh, not known for his coverage ability. great defense man that's uh, we're playing outstanding red zone defense right now fellas really nothing else to say about that one good tackle that's a good dot i had a hook curl there i don't i don't really know what my guy is guarding scream at him man come on baby let's go to sean elliott step up kid all right, boys, he asked me if he could leave. He's out of here. GG's. That is not the first time we're going to play him. We Just because we beat him the first time doesn't mean it's going to happen the second time. Uh, we, we'll see him again in week 17, but we take on two very good opponents. Again, we take on a playoff contender, the 8-4 Rams in week 15, and we take on the 9-3 Cowboys fancy in week 16. So some big games still to come. After a big win, it's time to take on the playoff contender, the Los Angeles Rams. Come on, man. Double coverage. Micah Hyde. Make a play, young man. Micah Hyde. Spin move. Oh, I didn't mean to jump. Oh, I don't want to fumble. Okay. All right. Going fullback dive here on second and goal from the one. Williams, he's in the end zone, man. Williams has been so good for us down here at the goal line. He gets in once again. No, sir. Oh, oh yeah. And pick it off, too. And pick it off, too. Awarie. Come on, baby. Oh, double spin move. He's off to the... Oh, he's running out of gas. He's running out of gas. We got to celebrate. We got to celebrate. Come on, man. Amani into the end zone. 14 nothing. What a play. In the pass. Easy dots. Baby Jamo, man. Come on. Take the 14-point lead. We have ball to half as well. Now, we got off to a really strong start in this game. We're going to go ahead and close it out. We actually get a force win, not a force win, but a fair sim win over the Cowboys in the following week as well over Fancy. And because of that, Fancy was actually eliminated from playoffs. He just slept in to like 4 or 5 p.m., missed our game time, got the loss. And then because of that, David T was locked for playoffs. He's going to go ahead and give us the win, giving us the one seed 
and the NFC North title, boys. We win the NFC North once again, and then we go ahead and uh, we take down the one seat in the NFC. So we get the first round by playoff game right around the corner. All right, guys, welcome back to an absolutely massive matchup versus one of the best offensive pro Madden players in the entire world. He made over $100,000 this year alone. I believe he finished in the semifinals of the Madden Bowl, the biggest Madden tournament in the world. This is going to be an incredibly difficult game, even though we're the higher seed i definitely think we're the underdogs here with that being said let's go ahead and deal with some things jump into the game and let's move on to our back-to-back -back conference championship here is the updated playoff bracket last season's winner actually gets knocked out in the very first round henry the five seed the chargers goes down to the chiefs now i'm gonna be honest i don't think henry played that kobo the chiefs is henry's friend i believe henry just gave kobo the win so yeah, I'm pretty sure that's what happened. You know, if it didn't, maybe Henry would go back to back. I would love to play him in the Super Bowl, get my rematch from our other Panther CFM. But we have some really awesome potential matchups here. We obviously play Astro on the other side of the NFC bracket here. We have Pavin and then Wesley who beat us pretty badly last year in the NFC Conference Championship. I don't know why I say conference champion, NFC conference, like that's just redundant. I gotta stop doing that, it's just a habit. But anyways, this is what it's looking like. Some really awesome matchups here. I'm excited for it. Um, let's go ahead and check out his team. All right, I'm gonna be honest, Astro's team is insane. And he made a ton, a ton of changes to the New Orleans Saints. One is Kirk Cousins is a 98 overall. His throw power is not the highest at only 88. But uh, 98 overall Kirk Cousins is insane. I believe he has over 7,000 passing yards this season. Uh, the league leader in that category, Alvin Kamara here, 90 speed, X factor, 99 overall. His wide receivers are Mike Evans, 98 overall, 98 speed, Will Fuller, and then Chris Olave, the second year vet now, 95 speed as well. Now for his secondary, he's got Sauce Gardner here, six foot three out of Cincinnati, 93 speed, 97 speed, Kalon Barnes. He's got 99 speed, Tariq Woolen. That is just, that's insane. That is an absolutely disgusting secondary right there. So much speed, amazing height to go, uh, you know, to go as well. Obviously that is a huge aspect of offense and defense in general in Madden this year. This is the first year where height has really made, you know, this much of a difference. He's got it at wide receiver. He's got it in his secondary. This team is absolutely loaded from top to bottom. Um, it's going to be a tough one, boys. All right, so one thing I actually want to clarify real quick is he has a 91 speed receiver, Traquan Smith, converted to tight end. So um, I'm going to go ahead and clarify, see if this is allowed or not. According to the rules, it's not, but maybe something, I, honestly, I don't know. I'm just going to ask. Yeah, so apparently it is allowed. I don't know why, but it just is. So I'm not going to complain about it. It's whatever. I'm just trying to play. But that's really all I'm trying to do, man. So let's get after it. All right, so he's got some really fast DBs. We probably just have to avoid those guys and we should be all right. Last time I played him, he played a ton of coverage. So I imagine that's what we're gonna get here early. DeAndre Swift. Oh, he runs out of juice, man. If we had some more stamina, that's probably a touchdown, but a big time play up to the 27 early on. I thought about throwing the S post for possibly a touchdown, but I'm not gonna take too many risks too early on here. Dave Davis, nice little spin move, buddy. There we go. Come on, across the 15. Oh, we had the running back there open, probably for a nice little pickup. Nice little check down, nice little check down. Pick up nine there. Uh, pressure gets there again. I think I'm gonna go for it early on, boys. Fourth and six. I feel like this is, I can pick this up. I feel like I can pick it up. DeAndre Swift, man, what a dot on fourth and six. We get in the end zone, beautiful start. We take the risk, it pays off. Now we gotta get a stop, boys, come on. Testing me early, testing me early, come on now. Come on, pick it. Come on, Trey Flowers. Let's go, kid. Come on. Get out of there. Spin move. We got a lane. Let's go, man. Come on. To stop early on, boys. Let's go. Nice little dot right there. Big pickup. Oh. 
Mm, that's a freaking laser, baby. Come on, Gabe Davis. Yes, sir. Get one more stop, hey, man. Get one more, kid. Put him to sleep. Wow, he threw another interception. Ori is just a little bit too slow. If that's anybody more than 89 speed, that is literally a touchdown. I knew exactly what play was coming, so I put one of my middle linebackers in a deep blue, a mid-third, and uh, he's just too slow, man. Anybody half a speed faster, and that is literally a pick. 21-0 first quarter. We're good. Let's drive down the field here and get more points. Spin move to Andre Swift. We're throwing some dots right now, boys. Throwing some dots. Come on. Ooh, good tackle. Good tackle. We got this first. Swift? Yes, sir. Don't fumble, please. Oof. I knew we were going to take a big hit. That's a good catch, though. Big pickup. But with the high ball here, he actually almost made a nice play, but we made an even better one. DeAndre Swift into the end zone. He actually left the wheel wide open, tried to click onto the blitzer to pick it up. I think we, I forget if I high balled it or if I waited a second. We had some good patience regardless. We get in the end zone. We got to get a stop, man. Come on. We know he's tilted. We know he's going to try to bomb us, and we can, we can take advantage of that. Flowers, bud. What are you? What are you playing there? You got acrobat. Like that could easily be a pick. Come on now. Pick. Come on, man. Get off me, stupid. Trey Flowers, dummy. Trey Flowers, pick number two of the game early. Now, now score and put him to sleep, man. It's gonna get real floody out here. Little playmaker action, come on now. And I fumble, wow. Ah, uh, that's just so unlucky. I mean, I get that I spun into him, but fumbles just aren't a thing this year. It's good, man. We got this guy bagged. We're completely dominating him right now. It doesn't matter. Just uh, stay cool, man. Stay cool. Wow, he just got lucky again. <laughs> oh man, that is brutal. I mean, dude. This dude is getting insanely lucky this game so far. Oh, he's, he just got insanely lucky. We're good, man, we're good. Let's just drive down the field here and get points. Come on now. Pick up DeAndre Swift. Let's go, baby. Come on. DeAndre Swift. I'm not going to score. I'm going down here. He's he's only got one timeout left. He's, you know, an explosive offensive player. I'm not giving him the ball back. I think this is 100% the right decision right here. They pick up Winston. Come on, baby. They pick up. What a play, Jameis. What a play, young man. Come on, kid. Fight for us. Well, ISO here. DeAndre Swift into the end zone. We did leave in 20 seconds, but I'm not too worried about that. I want to get in the end zone here. Take the 14-point lead. We are playing amazing right now. We should easily be up 21 points, but hey, it's fine. It's fine. We're up 14. Let's get another stop and really put this one away. Stupid. Come on now. It's my football. I'll be taking it off your hands. Oh. I'll be taking it off your hands. You don't need that. You don't need that football. It's my football, baby. You don't need that football. It's mine. Come on, kid. Oh, I went for the hobble. I shouldn't have. That was a wide open touchdown. I really just didn't want to throw a pick, especially a pick six right there. I'm going to go ahead, kick my three. We're going to take the three possession lead. Man, that would have been nice, though. I can't lie.
That would have been a really, really nice one. We'll take the three possession lead regardless. I mean, you can't play better. You literally cannot play better than that. We know he likes to go with the uh, the play action S post right here, so I'm watching for that. Oof, right over our heads. Come on, buddy. Mm, that's a nice little fade route versus the cover two right there. I kind of felt like he might do that after I saw him motion over. I think you have to motion to get that. That was a nice little play. I'm not going to hit on that one. That was nice. That wasn't open. Come on. Go for two. Go for two. Oh, Laurier. Just, just so terribly slow, man. All right. We're up 11 here. Let's just take some time off the clock. He's actually going to onside, which is perfectly fine with me here. What a beautiful, beautiful pass, man. Would love for that to be a touchdown, but hey, we'll take it up to the seven. Come on now. DeAndre Swift, beautiful change of direction, and we're into the end zone. Three possession lead once again, boys. Come on, make him work right here. No bomb plays. No bombs. What the hell was that? Something hit my window or something. Oh, I think it's raining, that's why. That actually makes a lot of sense. I'm not used to the rain, bro. It didn't rain in San Francisco. Let's go, Aiden Hutchinson, man. Way to pop up, kid. Way to pop up. Come on, baby. No, why did my guy... Why did my zone that was going to guard that just... Tackle. My zone just ran down for no reason when he was literally in a perfect position to go ahead and just... Make that play right there. Damn it, bro. Hopefully that rain's not loud. Honestly, I haven't messed with any of my settings to, like, make sure you guys can't hear it. So, I'm sorry if you can. We'll change that. Thank you. Wow, must have been GG's. Oh, he just threw a pick to JC Horn. Come on, man. Actually runs the football there, which is just really surprising. We make a nice tackle, though. Once again, wasn't expecting that really. Made a ton of hot routes. Oh, man, he actually tried to throw me a pick for the game, but it's okay. We live with that. I guess I just guessed. I'm just guessing wrong on the run. All right, we're still at 10 here. Got to take a lot of time off the clock. I imagine he probably onsides again. Recover it, baby. Don't take any hits. Recover it and don't take any hits. Gabe Davis, come on, man. Pick up this first right here. Pick up this first. Jameson Williams, beautiful baby. Come on. Nice run. Pick up the first again. I would have loved second and short there. Just because we're on milk mode now. Two possessions here going in the fourth quarter. But, I mean, we'll take the first. We'll take the first. Nice dot. I might have had a touchdown on my tight end right there. But we'll just take the first. I think it makes a lot of sense in this situation to go for this, so that's what we're going to do, boys. Uh, I think I have my running back there. I don't know if we would have picked up the first, but I accidentally pump faked on accident. We're still at two possessions, though. I think going, going for it right there um, is definitely the right move. I don't think not getting it is a big deal, but, you know, I would have loved to, obviously. D again, come on baby, just make him work this drive, come on now. Come on man, Micah Hyde, make a play baby, make a play Micah Hyde. Two minute warning two, fourth and 23, we're just backing everybody up. Actually, I might just send the dogs here man, I can't lie. Wow, I actually gave that to him, which is a little surprising, but... Is what it is. It's all right. Tackle, boys. Great tackle. 
Great tackle. Come on now. We can live with that. D, come on, Vicky. Great D. Come on. <laughs> I wasn't very open. That's all right. I wasn't very open. That's all right. All right, three point lead here. Let's go ahead and just uh, get one first down, man. It's over. Tight end wide open. Breaking the sack actually just cost me really, really badly. Wow. Tight end wide open, just standing on the sideline, no with the 20 yards, and it just goes to nobody for a pick six. That is brutal. a really sickening way to lose, man. That's a tough one. GG's, man. I just made a mistake there, I guess. I mean, I had my tight end open. I just threw off my back foot on accident. It's a really tough way to lose that one. I feel like we absolutely dominated that game, played way better than he did, and we just lost. It's a tough one, but hey, it happens. Ah, that was really going to be the season two, boys. Sorry to disappoint y'all, man. That, that one hurts. I can't lie. Just dominated the game and lost. Sucks.